this a matchup for the UFC welterweight division title? All right, so we've got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. <laughs> this one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. Beautiful strike. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Wow, what a kick. Oh! Wow. Oh, Masvidal on a real flow here, sticking and moving. The crowd is like just reacting every time he moves. Masvidal now has the crowd eating out of his hands. The one thing about Jorge that makes him so difficult to deal with is he never allows him to trap him. I think you got him trapped and try to get the core takedown, he evades and escapes. Phenomenal fighter. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. You wonder if the offensive fighter's going to start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Leg kick. That's a good right hand right he there. He has absorbed a lot of power shots. All right, throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. In fight numbers for you now, 29 total strikes have found the mark for Jorge Game Red Masvidal. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. Now a kick to the body. Midway through round one. Beautiful body kick. Masvidal gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Offensive fight, nice job to block the shot there. Well, for years, Tyron Woodley had said Jorge Masvidal is the best boxer on this UFC roster. Certainly showed you the hands there. I mean, he's showing it, man. I mean, this, I mean, he's showing it, John. This guy has an ability to stand and box with anyone in the UFC. And that was on full display when he beat Nate Diaz. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Both fighters throwing heat now. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Oh, collar tie. Nice punch, Lance. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Gamebrick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him. He's coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Keep going. Nice kick there by Green. And that left hook landed on the button. 
look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, strong. Oh! Now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting. Second round underway. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Beautiful head kick. Nice punch here. So he lands a double jab there. He continues to work off of that weapon, and you felt like that was a big key for him coming in tonight. Very important for him. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motions on the mat. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. And he landed the right hand there. Big kick land. Nice kicks there by Green. How about that chin? He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Oh, that's the fight thus How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Just out of the range with that right hand. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut of the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go off, dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout, and that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so a big, big win for him here tonight. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC, and he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, it was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick, over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing.